my memory's pretty good, in his novel, Kim. I almost bought that for my son, Rex, yesterday. Kim, I was at a rare bookstore. I'm going to go back and get that. I almost bought him Kim. Sc scroll down for me. I forgot I read that when I was a kid. And then it just gets into divide and conquer, how they balkanize different tribes off against each other. You can see what they did in India right there, what they did in Pakistan. This is a public operation. They're going to run a great game on us here. The, the drug war is a great game. You ship most of the drugs in. You then control the big crime gangs. You shut down the small ones. You corrupt the police. And you imprison the general population who dares use the drugs for being so stupid. And then you put them in private prisons, competing with the rest of the economy, lowering wages so only drugs is the economy. Oh, how did the British take down China? I forgot the opium wars, <laughs> which is even pre-great game, but is great game. I mean, does anyone really want to know how the world works? Because it's all there. Tiger, tiger in the night. Tiger, tiger, burning bright. If there is the brightest star in the night, you know it is the... John, Bill, Mike, Jacob, James, I'm going to go to all of you, but I'm going to say it again. I'm giving you the Death Star plans right now. I'm giving you the Rosetta Stone. I'm giving you the public documents of how this works. Are we all that dumb? That's what football's about. Coke, Chevy, Cowboy, Redskin. Black, white, male, female, gay, straight. This is how they just get us all obsessed on these surface issues while we're all being gang raped by the globalist. Now, after I take phone calls, I'm going to, at the bottom of the hour, I will get into this. North Korea threatened strikes on U.S. amid hacker claims. They deny they've launched the hack attack, but then say they'll basically blow up the White House. They can't even... They've got like 50-year-old Russian cars they drive there. Uh, but it, you talk about a Rosetta Stone. North Korea and Kim Jong-un is an example of, of, you like big government moving to North Korea. It's an example of how pathetic the state is, what the state finally degenerates into when, when the state is God. When the state cannot be checked, when the state cannot be challenged. It creates stagnation and literal hell on earth. A dark age. The dark age devil kingdom. And then it's run by a toddling little wimp who can hardly walk at like, what is he, 25 years old or something? Third generation king who thinks it's cool to have Dennis Rodman who wasn't cool 15 years ago. Who talks like Sauron. That's a joke video I saw comparing Dennis Rodman to Sauron's voice. I mean, and now these guys hacked Sony. I mean, this is all a psyop in my view. I've sat back and watched it, looked at it. North Korea has denied it. But they had to add their normal, we will blow your country up. And the minute the globalists want to, they'll just blow something up, say North Korea did it, and we're off the races. North Korea is absolutely horrible, absolutely terrible. But the people running us are a thousand times more sophisticated and at the end of the day, evil. I mean, North Korea is a lens into what government worship creates. Fox investigation, CDC may be hiding thousands of Ebola cases. That was on Fox News yesterday with an investigative report. I just know I got medical doctors saying, yeah, there's Ebola. And they just disappear the people. Just shows how they control things. Borders wide open. Nobody even seems to know that. We're going to get into uh, Time Magazine saying right-wing militias are the real threat to cops. So they're getting everybody prepared for that. That's up on Infowars.com. I'm going to go to break and come back, and I'm going to take your calls right through to the bottom of the hour. Then I'll get into North Korea, the latest on censorship with Team America and the interview. Saudi oil chief says no conspiracy behind oil prices. <laughs> that's a funny one because we know there's a it, OPEC's rigged. That's that's come out. Gun control advocate urges kids to inform on their parents, turning their firearms. 
actually tells kids to steal them out of the house and take them to the police. Pretty amazing stuff. That's all coming up. I want to thank all of the listeners, our AM and FM affiliates, for making the show possible, supporting our sponsors. Be sure and support our local AM and FM affiliates. Become sponsors or support local sponsors and let them know why you're supporting them. Spread the word about the broadcast. Get friends and family sitting around, you know, the, the tree this year. Get their iPhone, get their Droid, say, hey, download the free apps at InfoWars.com forward slash show. And you can still, you can't order the, the, the products at InfoWarsStore.com and still get them by Christmas. But you can go to PrisonPlanet.tv where we have the nightly news, this show simulcast, all my films, and so much more. It takes one minute to sign up. It's $29.95 right now for a year. It's at a $54.95. 20 memberships for the price of one. That's $2.50 a month. 12 cents a person is what it comes down to. PrisonPlanet.tv. You can, for $5.95, you can get a month trial membership and 20 people. You can be done with their Christmas shopping and give them the username and they can log on. Bam. Silver has always been nature's very own antibiotic, and only one system allows you to generate an endless supply of natural silver solutions, silverlungs.com. You'll find no wild claims or pseudoscience, just a lifetime of nano-sized pure silver solutions. The Silver Lungs Generator allows you to make your own, so stop paying for silver solutions. The unique lung delivery system targets respiratory infections where other silver solutions simply cannot reach. See the Silver Lungs Generator and Lung Delivery System at silverlungs.com. That's silverlungs.com. I love a dark house. Inside is all the stuff you work so hard for. And I'm going to rob you blind. Don't be the next victim of a break-in. Go to faketv.com and discover a device that creates the illusion someone is inside watching TV and makes your home unappealing to would-be thieves. Don't these people ever leave? Starting at $24.95 and there's free shipping. Go to faketv.com or ask for it at your local hardware store. Fake TV, the burglar deterrent. Hey everyone, I'm having lots of fun with my new Ghost 80% AR-15. This baby shoots like a dream. Hey, thanks Guns80.com. You know, friends ask me all the time why I wanted a Ghost AR-15. That's easy. You see, my buddy Mark kept telling me that I'd better go to Guns80.com to get myself a Ghost AR-15 before they outlawed them. I thought he was just paranoid, so I ignored him. Well, at first. But then I started hearing government media types talking about making guns illegal about the president signing on to a U.N. treaty that could take my gun rights away. You know, it really bugged me. So I dug in, I did the research, and I realized that Mark was right all along. I know now that having an unregistered Ghost AR-15 is the right answer. I'm a proud 80% Ghost AR-15 convert. You should be, too. The answer is really simple. Get your Ghost AR-15 at guns80.com. The big sale is on. Right now, go to guns80.com. That's guns80.com. Guns80. The number's 80.com. Hi, folks. Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. <laughs> Monday through Friday from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central. We're here live. Back weeknight, 7 o'clock Central, InfoWars Nightly News. And I again want to thank all the PrisonPlanet.tv members. Let's go to John in Texas on the police topic. Um, it's so transparent, even former deputy director of the FBI has come out and said that the White House and the Justice Department are responsible for promoting this narrative. It's so transparent 
it's almost like there's a civil war in the government as well. Obama has the lowest approval rating of any modern U.S. president since they started taking polls. Uh, that's in the news today. The military absolutely loathes him. So the good news is uh, the whole system isn't buying into this uh, tyranny. The bad news is it doesn't matter because they're still getting it all through. What's your take on this, John? Oh, you know, Alex, back in 1980 and when I was living in Michigan, I, I lost my job at Chrysler's and I had to uh, take a job working a, for a security company driving a patrol car. And I had to work with a lot of, a lot of police. And by and large, most of them treated me good, and I didn't have no problem. But once in a while, one of them would get up in my face and start screaming, call me a pretend cop, and what the hell I was doing there. And uh, and it was all I could do to hold my temper, you know. That, uh, but what I'm saying is a lot of cops are their own worst enemy, you know. Just uh, There is an extreme you. arrogance in a minority of them, and the police should absolutely route that out. Or it's going to allow the globalists to scapegoat them into an explosive civil war. I mean, do you agree with my point that the establishment, the George Soroses, want the cops to get the blame for everything instead of the system? Well, they want to destroy the police, period. That's, you know, they want to put their police in there. They'll probably bring them from overseas or something, you know. They want us to turn on our cops. That's part of the game plan, you know. Exactly. So how do we navigate this? I don't know, but you got all these communist agitators out here forming all this stuff. I mean, they've, they've been there since the 1960s, and it, and people are going to have to realize that's who's causing all this unrest. And uh, and uh, they want they want a revolution. That's you know they want to be another Lenin or another uh, the Trotsky or whatever. You know. That's it. It's a great game. I mean, British intelligence. I I can't believe that even on Wikipedia, they have links to major universities. They admit. Uh, that the British helped bring down Russia, putting the communists in. That is so hardcore, cold-blooded. And then, and then the CIA and British intelligence put Mao in. That just lets you know who's running the show. I mean, these people are evil, and they now want to finally bring down what's left of America. And I just hope we're not stupid enough to go along with it. Good to hear from you, John. Bill in Michigan, uh, first timer on the police topic. Uh, so, what do you think is happening? Uh, yes, Alex. Uh, your last caller here in Michigan, he hit the nail right on the head. And uh, I disagree with these people just shooting, you know, our police officers. There is a lot of good ones out there, but there's also a lot of them that are out of control. And here in Michigan, I blame our governor, uh, Ricky Bloomberg Snyder, you know. We have all these, uh, oh like drunk driving stings and seatbelt stings. And, I mean, they're pulling you over in the middle of the day for a burned-out headlight. Oh, yeah, it's total police state, revenue generation, totally federalized, predatory, uh, and it's out of control. It is, you know, and, I mean, but what are, what, I mean, shooting police officers isn't our solution, but us citizens, you know, I mean, are we just out here for prey for them or, you know? Well, the argument is you need to follow the law. I mean, half the Americans can't even pay for their inspection sticker now. Are you supposed to walk to work? I mean, the country is falling apart. And it seems like the worse the economy, the more tickets they're writing. Meanwhile, Google and General Electric are, are tax exempt, and I pay 43% tax. It's just totally screwed up. Good to hear from you. Mike in New York. If that's the Mike that's called in for years, he's a retired police officer. I don't, I don't know if that's him. Uh, he hadn't called in about six months. And then we've got Jacob, James, Damien, and many others. Second hour, coming up in 70 seconds. I'm Alex Jones. Thank you for listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. The government's Department of Homeland Security is buying up loads of ammo. At the same time, they're restricting civilians' rights to own and purchase firearms. Can you put two and two together? Infidel body armor can stop every round, including hollow points and 308 sniper rounds. Is reasonably priced and fully legal. But for how long? Go to InfidelBodyArmor.com, spelled I-N-F-I-D-E-L, BodyArmor.com. Infidel Body Armor just won't quit.
The average person's life is filled with unexpected challenges. Unlock the energy it takes to defeat these daily beasts with super male or super female vitality, specifically designed to assist the body in regulating proper hormone balance to create superior vitality in males and females. Supercharge and conquer your world at InfoWarsLife.com or call 188-253-3139.